everybody, and welcome back to uh, Minecraft Tales. Apparently when I crouch, I can see my username on Nugget. Why? I didn't know that. Anyway, uh, in today's episode, I was going to make a bunch of fairy lights, but as always, I screwed up, and I used all my iron on the actual light parts, so I had to go mining. So right now, I'm smelting a bunch of iron so I can make more fairy lights, but for the time being, I only have four, unfortunately. So yeah, we've done a lot of progress getting the village back together. I'm going to stand on the tent. So as you can see, I've gotten a bunch of stuff done. All of us, all the houses are done. They just need a roof and people to live in them. Anyway, we're going to go check on everybody. And then in today's episode, I'm actually going to build a bridge. And I'll explain that later. But hello, Evelyn. I can't wait until we are done repairing the village. I can't wait either. What are you doing, Nick? It's kind of weird not having my helmet on. I wore it for so long, I even slept in it sometimes. Why? Why would you sleep in your helmet? Dude, <laughs> what are you two talking about? I'm only about 2,100. What about you? Guessing from how long I was in that crystal, I'm probably a bit over 4,650? What? Oh, right, they're elves. Wait, really? 4,650, yeah. What the hell? She's four and a half thousand years of old, okay. What's up, Jacob? Me and Brian found a massive clay deposit in the mines. Maybe we can use it to make the roofs or the houses. They will last much longer than wood. Wait, you guys found a clay de like, as in clay clay, the clay you use to make bricks? Like this kind of clay. You guys found clay? Because if we have that, we can make bricks. And that means we'll have better roofs. Okay, well, I'm gonna help mine that out. We need that. What's going on over here? Oh my god. Hello, Hunter. What is he? What's that? Come on, Hunter. I know you want to join them. Aww. Is he approaching them? Go, child. You must be friends. Are they all just, like, saying hi? They are. That's so cute. Hi, Erica. I'm glad they're all getting along. I'm glad they're getting along, too. Where did... We have sheep. I forgot about the sheep. I almost fell in the pen. Hi, Daniel. What are you doing? I can't believe we've gotten this much progress done in a couple days. It's impressive. It, 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 yeah, no. This is because Minecraft boredom. I help him. The forest is dangerous at night. Too many dark places for people to hide. I don't go in the forest. Because mobs... Too many mobs spawn in there. Because it's really dark. Hi. My gods, Olivia. You look like you're about to burst. I know. Moving around is just a struggle. I... have I keep forgetting you're pregnant. Okay, then. Hi. I can't wait to set up another shop while well, I enjoy running them. I've, got, I've been wanting to open a little general store. An extra income for our family would be good. And then I do as well. Honestly, I'm glad I put all that work into that bakery for it to be gone. But hopefully this time I can actually get it open before it blows up. Yeah, hopefully. What the hell? What? How? Okay. Our community is sure nice. What? How in the hell? How are you even doing that? What? I'm on top of the world! What? I... I... I, I don't understand. Brick roofs will be harder to build, but I should be able to help create them. Martha wants to open a little shop in the village and make clothing. I think it's a great idea. Didn't you say that last time? Uh, I was just digging around and hit a massive clay area. We tried to dig around it at first, but kind of gave up after a while. Awesome. Is that everyone? No, it's not everyone. Hi, Leo. It shouldn't be too long before construction is done. Yeah, I know. And there's those two. Uh, anyway, is my iron almost done? Yes, yes it is. Give me that. So now, all I need is a bunch of lights and string. And I can do this. That's the wrong spot. So there, and there, and there, and now I have a ton. Did that really only make me like 30? Really, game? Okay, whatever. I need to go mining. Desperately. So anyway, we're going to run over here, and I want to place it between the buildings. So what I've done is I've gone through each of the houses. Each of the houses has been lit up with torches. So all of them have been lit up. It's only the outside that does not have light. And that is because I wanted to do this on each of the houses. It gives it light and it looks pretty. And I'm not going to have nearly enough for this. 
So hopefully I don't have to place torches on the in-between part. I might actually have to. Because I'm not quite sure if this is going to be enough. We'll find out. Although, eh. It doesn't really work in the middle because it's too short. So maybe, what if I placed it higher and on like the wooden beam part? Just grab all that. It's like, what if I put it like up here? Oh, I can't. Ah, I see. Can I place it on these? I can't place them on the things either. Oh, but I can put them on here. But you can't see it. Why are they invisible? Okay, that's weird. Uh, does this work? No, it's about the same length. So maybe if I put it like this. Yeah, that works. That way it's long enough but it still gives light. It's gonna look weird on the corners though. Yeah, it does. So I think I'll just have it on the inside part and then I'll figure out what to do on the outside. So I'm gonna go around and I'm gonna place all these and hopefully it works. Maybe I should put a block in between actually. All right, I've placed all of the fairy lights all around the um, buildings. So hopefully this should be sufficiently lit up at night. Uh, if there are areas that don't have enough light, I am going to go around with just a bunch of torches and place them in nice areas. And I found a way to bridge the gap over here. I just used a slab on each of the things. And then in the middle here, if I can get it, I'm going to get like glowstone and cover it with carpet. Or maybe I'll just put a torch there and cover it with carpet. That way the in-betweens are lit up enough so mobs don't spawn. But yeah, other than that, the village is looking a lot nicer now. And hopefully as soon as I get the roofs on, people can stop living in tents, which will be good. So yeah, now we're going to move on to what I actually wanted to do today, which was build a bridge. And I'm going to go grab my materials and explain that, if I can find them. Alright, so I have all this stone. I'm going to make it into bricks. So what I wanted to do is, we're going to split the village between the, um, the river. So we're going to have a bunch of housing and shops on the left side, and on the right side, we're either going to do more housing or more shops depending. Uh, I don't know yet. I'm still trying to figure that out. Oh crap, I fell on thing. Anyway, over here I've kind of like laid out the mapping for like a little construction area. It's kind of like a bunch of shops in a little town center. And it will, this will get bigger as we go, but I'm gonna have to do this stuff in between episodes, but I thought for the time being, I would build a bridge. I need a crafting table. I forgot to grab one. But anyway, I wanted to put a little bridge over here just to start it off because the canal is definitely going to be bigger. As you can see, I've already kind of started like building it. This took a long time and I'm almost completely out of cobblestone now. So now I'll just put that in there. And if I can get it right, we're going to make some stairs. So what I wanted to do is have a five long bridge. That's five, right? Yeah, it is. And that way, I can just do this. And then put that there. Can I make this jump? No. Great. Uh, you know what? Let's just do this because it's easier. And now on this side, we're going to do the exact same thing. So block it off here, upside down staircase. I hear a horse, oh there's a horse right there. <laughs> and then one final, if I can jump that thing here. Oh, I ran out of stairs. Brilliant. Well, I can just finish this off. Or, ah, just cripe. Is that too tall? No, that seems tall enough. Yeah, that should be tall enough. I just need to make some more stairs. So, I think I really only need to make one set, so... If I put this here... So, okay, put that there. And then... What the hell? There's a fox. Why is there a fox? 
Come back, little fox. Why is there a fox? You guys see that? Come back. Why is the fox running? Why is the fox so small and golden? I saw a fox over there. That fox is big and orange. Why are you running from me? Come back. See, that fox is tiny and golden. Why are the rest of the foxes orange? No, where are you going? I just want to be your friend. If I can get through the brush. Come back. I got stuck on. What the hell? Why was there- why is there a little fox? No, come back! Come back! Where'd he go? There he is. Why am I chasing a fox through the woods? Oh god, I'm lagging. No! Where- okay, where did he- what the hell? What? Is this like a shrine gate? There's someone inside there. Yuri. There's the- is, that's the fox? It's bigger now. Hi? Let me just put this in my back pocket. Hello? And who might you be? Has Fen has Fenix brought here brought in a stray? I'm the lord of this region. The lord, I see. I thought this I though this region was dead and buried. Not a soul in sight. Although if Fenix led you here, then who are you? Me? Oh, my name is Yuri, and this is my younger brother, Fenix. We are humanoid species of fox known as Wolfwin. We aren't from this region, clearly. Where did- why are- where did you come from? Me and my brother came here looking for a quiet place to settle. We were working out of this small cave, but something is, well, off. That did not answer my question. And what do you mean, off? Hmm, would you be willing to help us with our little problem? It wouldn't take long. What is it? Well, recently I felt like some kind of magical disturbance I've been unable to figure out what it is. Or its exact source. If you wouldn't mind, I would appreciate your assistance in finding this disturbance. Okay. Thank you so much. Me and Venix will look into another area as well. Are you the fox I was chasing? Yep. Okay. This place is pretty. It's like a tiny little cave, but it's got grass in it. And glowstone. Okay. So there's just a fox woman in here. Does she have- oh yeah, she does have a tail. So... I guess she wants me to look around for some magic? Like, what, what would I even be looking for? I don't mess with magic. I just teleport places, because I have mods. There's a pumpkin. There are a lot of pumpkins. I guess I should just wander around until I find something. Okay, there's a wizard tower, but that's not a, that, it's not weird. That's a part of one of my mods. Okay, I, I guess I'll just wander around until I find something. This is weird. <laughs> Who the hell are you? So you must be that little lord sticking your nose and everything. Who the hell are you? Who am I? I'm the bringer of darkness, a knight of the underworld. Although, I think you can work out the rest on your own, little lord. As soon as I complete my missions, I can finally become the captain's right hand. Now hold still, I'll make this nice of- What? Uh... Where did you come from? Hello? I must apologize for not appearing sooner. With Ashton in the area, I believe my and Fenix's current location has been compromised. I fear we will need to find a new location if these knights are here. Uh... Is there anywhere else you can go? Unfortunately, no. We are current. We were counting on Oshu since it was abandoned spiritually so long ago, but it seems I am wrong if the Ashen are here. Uh, in that case, why not come to my village? Your village? You mean in that tacky bunch of houses near the river? It's not tacky! Oh, my apologies. I guess we have no other options. If you don't mind, we'd be honored to relocate to your village. <laughs> Why does that seem... Why does that seem backhanded? Yep. Alright, do we just leave him here? I guess. I'm not sure what to do. I guess let's start walking back. Alright, we should almost be there now. It should just be up ahead. So... Oh, is that it over there? Yeah, I think that's it. Let's go! 
Helbert, what the hell? Where did you come from? Oh my, that was a surprise. Where did you? What the hell is the fox doing? Where did you guys come from? What? My, my, is that any way to treat a lady? I suggest one of you call off your hound unless you wanted to lose his arm. Helbram, what the hell is wrong with you? Get off her. She obviously means- Helbram! Why? What did she do? Helbram! <laughs> Fine, but one incident and I'll slice her head clean- Helbram, what is wrong with- No! Is there- Is there- Okay, is there something wrong with Helbram? He's done that- I think this is the second time he's done something like that. Yuri, are you okay? I wonder what that was about. I hope the others in your village aren't as enthusiastic as him. Although something about his aura seems off for a human. What do you mean off? I mean, he's like three times my size, but... Do you have anything to say for yourself? No, no, you do not. The only thing I see that's... The only thing I see that's off about him is that he's significantly taller than me. And I'm not even that small. Nugget, I forgot you were with me. Hi. Uh, Nick, why are you guys out here? Lady Kitten, are you alright? Who is this fox woman with you? What are you two doing over here? Someone said they saw you chasing a fox in the forest, and I, we got worried. If you don't mind me asking, who is this woman, and what happened? Uh, I don't want to make them worry. This is Yuri and Fenix. Yuri and Fenix? Is Fenix the fox besides her? No matter, we should get back to the village before any more events aspire. Why? Like, there was no reason for that. We were just walking back to- Oh god, Nugget is walking away. Oh, I need to feed my dog. But there was no reason- Actually, I can see the village- Wait a minute. There's roofing on that house. I can barely see it in my render distance. I will investigate that later. But, for now, I'm gonna end the episode here before anything else goes down. Yeah, see? There's brick on that house in the background. But yeah, I will see you guys all in the next episode. I hope you enjoyed this one. Uh, I guess we're going to get this resolved in the next episode. And we'll build Yuri a house. And Fenix too. And I think Nugget would like me to feed her. Or him. I don't remember what gender my dog is. I just remember your name is Nugget and you have a yellow collar. But yeah, I hope you guys all enjoyed. And I will see you all next time. Bye. Look how much shorter I am than him.